All right, Crypto 101 here. In this video, you're going to learn why Edgeless is going to be the top leading online casino that's smart contract based. They're pretty much on a league of their own and no one can compete with them. I'm going to explain to you why. Also, I got an invitation to do a quick demo on their new game called Crash. So stick around and we'll see what's going on in this new game. Alright, so we have here their website front page and alright, this is where the players have the most even playing field out of all the casinos. If they play at Edgeless, they have a higher chance of winning because of the full transparency and random number selections that are done by Edgeless. All other casinos that you go online, it's all rigged. Obviously the house is going to win no matter what, but with this you can see full transparency, they're giving you a even playing field when you're gambling in their casino all right so that's the reason why they call it zero edge because the casino does not have an edge over their customers here so the only advantage they have is that they don't have a limit whereas the customers like us we do so we play until we run out of money most of the time right all right so the games are dice blackjack baccarat crash that's the new one here i'm going to show you they have sports betting coming up and poker as well now who's the bank so it's not them, it's actually a community funded bankroll. So you stake your tokens to fund it. Ah, uh, okay, so this is a continual process. Uh, so it doesn't rely on the casino owners to have enough funding to allow people to gamble. So, all right, that's pretty interesting. I gotta take a look at this. All right, so in order to fund the bank, the casino's money, Edge will actually invest 60 million Edge's tokens while the community invests 40 million here. For example so it's a 60 40 percent rule that to follow so it's great community can actually stake their tokens to be a part of this bank casino who wouldn't want to be on the casino side of all this right um now you have the people that play they also tend to make mistakes like they probably hit the wrong time you know during when they're playing blackjack they'll probably hit 18 or something on blackjack you know like like just mistakes like that and errors so i guess the advantage is always going to be with the house because the the rules of the games are designed for the casino to win great way to be a part of the bank system here and using a community's money to also invest into the bank role for the casino to operate hey that's a great way to make money on, on the side too so i might even consider staking my money on this online casino bank all right so bloomberg even brought them up all right best part of edgeless zero percent edge over what the casino have all right over the players fully compliant kyc all that it's not allowed in the u.s using crypto ethereum mainly other casinos don't instant token cash out some casinos you have to wait who wants to wait two three days to get their money that they want so edges they took that part out and full transparency on the blockchain all right nobody else can offer full transparency with their system if they do it slows down the entire process of gambling which makes it no fun because i'm reading articles where it takes about two minutes to randomize the number from a third party company and to deal the card also getting the blockchain involved to put in the wager it just takes too much time so with edgeless you're using ethereum erc20 to pull money out and put money in is when you withdraw what you put in and that's it everything else is handled within the website so that's why it's so fast and that's why it's possible with edgeless all right so let's get into the games that's what you guys came here for very simple they have blackjack here dice back rack crash let's go and start with blackjack first all right screen loading up there's my wager i'm just do 20 cents all right 14 and he has five what do i want to do do i want to hit um you know what they could bust but i feel like 14 might be too low let's go ahead and hit let's try 15, you know what? Mm, I don't want to take my chance, I'll stand. 17, I lost. Okay, so next one, I'm going to bump it up a little bit, all right? So right over here is how much edge tokens I have. I just put a dollar just for fun. Here's $2 extra, so deal. All right, 20, stand. 16, 18, I won. $2.20 right here, I'm up. All right, so very simple. Um, here's dice here's another game that you can play here at this center bar it's only a two payout meaning meaning if I bet a dollar I'll get two dollars out so that's a two dollar payout so that's me I win an extra dollar so I double my money if that happens if I hit this side the green area so under 50 anything over 50 is a loss so let's go ahead and play that 
roll the dice and the dice says 99 I lost so I lost a dollar um, you can also adjust the scale to 99 here all right so with the payout here it says a dollar and one cents so now when I win anything if it lands anything under 99 I would get my dollar back and also one cent so it's an easy win but the tiny chance you might hit that one percent on this side and you can lose your dollar all right just want another one there hit seven so now the thing is speed all right so this is one of the most attractive points about edgeless the entire functionality with the whole website it works flawlessly right because it's all built in to the website the server is actually handling all this so it's not done on a blockchain which would draw down the playtime speed so this is very important so now they already developed a full working system functioning flawlessly i had no issues playing any of the games here um the thing is the aesthetic so it'll be nice to see the dice roll graphically right and then see it hit the number seven and also some uh, background appearance but they took care of the most important part which the functionality because that's the hardest part of any blockchain or any website dealing with automation they took care of that and it works flawlessly right now so the next thing they need to do is make it aesthetically appealing more like get you in the field like you're in a casino so more visuals would greatly enhance this website's appearance and make it more fun and more entertaining but most important part is taken care of and i'm very sure once they move forward getting all the games done like all of these here they could then move forward to actually improve the aesthetics but once they do that they can be the top online casino blockchain casino that we have seen and they also have their license so they could go a lot farther than most others can no one's in their league in terms of the speed and functionality. They got it down. All right. So they got this part down. They just got to work on aesthetics and they'll be on top. All right. So there's Baccarat. I'm just going to go straight to Crash. So this is a new game demo that only a few people are allowed to play. All right. So you can see there's only 11. Not everyone is allowed to actually use this. Only the selected few. So, you know, I got a chance to check it out. But here we go. So it's pretty much a parabolic graph line that moves up and gives you your multiple. So let's go ahead and put a bet here. I'm going to bet a dollar and place my bet there. All right, so multiple of one. I need to get a two. It says max 2.0 right here before I can win my money and double it. All right, reached it. Now, the thing is, it's capped off at 2.0. I'm not sure if this is because it's a demo, but it makes um, a 5x gain right here. I'm not sure if what's going to happen after the demo, but this limit should get increased instead of just 2x. All right, I just won the first one. Let's go for the second one. Let's see how far we can take this. When this thing goes parabolic, it goes very fast. So this thing reminds me of just like Bitcoin, 20,000. All right, I just hit 2x. Let's see how far I can go. Hopefully, I mean, at this point, 3.8 so we'll see when after the demo if the limit's going to be increased and this is going to get taken away there, i can see that people can make a lot of money playing this game multiply right here and we'll see how it actually works once they increase this limit but this is just a demo and so far it seems like i like this game more than the other one blackjack is fun too definitely this is something that uh you can see the parabolic movement and get you excited just to see this thing go 1x 2x 3x 5x so waiting for this to go fully live i'm going to come back and play this again just to you know try to see if i get 10 or 20x it happens but this is all ran randomly generated and i'll show you over here you can see that they use the server seed which are sha3 hash okay so these are hashes that come in so the best example is if i actually went back to blackjack right just to show you what i mean so let's go ahead and play a hand all right so now what i want to show you is client c this was a transaction hash that was given so it goes through a random processor and then that's the number i got 14 okay the server seed this is the hash transaction id number that the house got and the number came out to be two right after a process in the random generator it generated the number two that's visually shown but um once they open the card we can see the actual number so it's all automated and they could process if you won or lost you know right then and there so it's fully transparent if you're talking about playing on a casino online 
and trying to get the best odds to win, then you want to play at a place like Edgeless, where it's fully transparent and it's not rigged. Why would you want to play in a casino that's rigged against your against the odds for you? You know, so it only makes sense to play in a casino like this and that's why edgeless has a huge advantage becoming the, the top online online blockchain casino that the world has met all right so this is new and they got their license too so they can fully push this forward so very excited to see more from edgeless their new games coming out and definitely aesthetic upgrade would make everything complete but when that happens you can expect the price to be a lot farther than what it is now so right over here we have edgeless at 27 cents now, all-time high, just like everything else, is down. All altcoins are down 90%. All right, so keep in mind, altcoins down 90%. That's a huge discount. That's the time we should be moving in and not being scared. So I would continue to start looking at altcoins even down to 95%. I mean, that's an even better price. But this thing has to turn around. Nothing goes down forever. That's just the law of how the prices work. All right, so they have a 26 million market cap. This is not a small company. It's not a small project. They rank 163 on coin market cap. All right, and there's 1,800 coins and they're ranked 163. So they're doing very well in terms of being on a spotlight. All right, they're up there and it's very competitive and they have a solution for playing for allowing the users to play at an even playing field online right so and just like i mentioned earlier this is a system that they use in order to generate randomly so you have the seed from the casino the seed from the player the transaction it gets put into here which automatically generates a random number for the cards or whatever dices that you get so it identifies the winner and there you go it just gets withdrawn into your ethereum wallet address when you want to pull it out so now another method that people use this is the old method if they want to use a third party random like random.org to generate random numbers it has to go through this system here which requires four requests to ethereum you know the ethereum system is slow so there's no way you could tie in the ethereum blockchain to a game i tried video games i tried online games it's just slow any, anything with the Ethereum blockchain is not going to be fast enough to be playable, right? So Edgeless took care of that just with this method. So it's a hybrid between a centralized and decentralized system, which works great. You know, on the blockchain, it has transaction IDs where it randomized and allows a player full transparency of the gaming, all right? So here are some um, other comparisons of other casinos that are blockchain based. And this one here, one to two minutes to generate a number randomly too long gas price one dollar and six cents too expensive why would play there no one play there all right three to five minutes to generate a number gas price a dollar 61 ridiculous too expensive too slow here's another one here that's their top competing casino that they're going against but it's not the same as apple and oranges when you're comparing these two online casinos but look how slow it gets when you're trying to run on their system all right so they haven't got this figured out but great they got the aesthetics that's the easy part and um, when edges finishes their site and have the aesthetics come out they're gonna be they're gonna be complete they're gonna have the fastest transaction times they're gonna have the lowest gas costs and they're gonna be the only one where the casino has zero edge against your playing all right, so look, look how long it took for them to actually process just to make a make a game go. All right, so this is Funfair. This is also set on the highest game speed, and I'm not sure who made this demo, but if this actually happened once, it could happen again. So um, it's just not good because I've seen another video where Funfair, some person was trying to demo their smart contract games, and it didn't process. It just didn't work. All right, so there at least a lot of problems. You know, the blockchain is not perfect, especially Ethereum. You could try to send transaction and it fails if it doesn't have enough right amount of gas. There's a lot of problems that could happen, but Edges took care of that. So on to the next one. Here we go. Less than one second, right? So at least Funfair was able to catch up with the speed, but it seems like there's problems that made it lag out. I don't trust the speed on <laughs> that rating right there. But I, I tested Edgeless and it's fast. And you've seen it firsthand yourself. You've seen Edgeless is super fast. Had no problem playing that. All right. So and the cost five cents USD. So they're still working on it, and it's going to cost less than five cents per transaction. You can keep playing that way. That's a lot of uh, that's a lot of games you can play with five cents. Now usually most casinos, you know, you go in in public. It's I don't know. Some people charge a dollar fees each time you play a game, but. Hey, five cents who could deny that why would you want to go to a casino when you can actually just play out the comfort of your own home 
with lower fees and quick response times. All right, so it's playable. Now, Edges becomes the first legal blockchain casino. So they took the lead on this and they're fully compliant. KYC all involved if you want to actually start withdrawing funds. There you go, they're the first. So that's huge breakthrough. This happened during uh, December 2017. And as you know, we're moving into a fully regulated blockchain space. So for them to get their license already, that's already a big heads up uh, over everyone else that's trying to get involved into blockchain casinos. Kudos to them. Great job on that. They got that done. All right. So this is the growth of uh, online casino gambling. So we're currently around 55 around 50 billion all right in 2018 look how it grown over the past decade it's seeing exponential growth at this point you can see that it's doubling and then boom it just hit more in 2018 now throwing blockchain involved now with online gaming you don't have to use your credit card anymore and it's more safer that way because you know where, where your funds are going if it's a, a fully licensed platform like a casino website like edgeless i mean i would feel safe throwing my bitcoins in there right so so if you've seen a growth from seeing growth from close to 30 billion to 50 billion just imagine in 2020 it could be 80 billion maybe 90 billion this thing could, it's gonna grow faster and faster as people play online internet is just becoming more prevalent everyone's using internet right now so of course they're gonna get addicted somehow to something and i personally do not gamble but i know a lot of other people that gamble and logically for me i know the odds so i don't play but for other people, most people are not rational, so they'll still end up playing and get addicted and, you know, continue to play until they lose all their money. But that's just how it is. And no matter what, there's still a high demand for gambling. There's always going to be demand for this and it's going to only going to grow as time goes on. So blockchain online gambling will be the future because of the full transparency that allows people to play with an even playing field against a casino for once. All right, this is the only way that I can make it happen. Any other online casino, there's no way they can actually prove it to you because there's no blockchain. All right, so they could they could say they randomly generate whatever numbers, but they could just give you whatever odds to favor the house, and you can lose a lot of money doing that. This only makes sense that people will come and gamble on Edgeless. All right, so all right, so come check this out. You know, be the bank for Edgeless, be a player if you feel lucky and maybe invest into some of the coins here and it's only at 27 cents and the value will actually the value will continue to grow because people will be using edgeless in order to have even playing field when gambling the cards that's dealt all right so only buy when the price drops all right do not do not this is a bear market right now don't buy anything when the price pumps at this point we're just trying to accumulate low and it's good to have an alternative category of coins that you don't have in your portfolio so having some privacy coins having some protocol coins and having some currency coins bitcoin bitcoin cash and also throwing in an online casino there's always a lot of money in gambling always going to be so it's good to diversify and check it out cumulate low on the way down don't buy the hype and don't buy on the way up especially in the bear market all right, so that's it for my video. So comment below if you guys have any questions. So if you guys feel like there's a better odd winning with Edgeless or not, and what do you guys think about being a bank for Edgeless, right? Wouldn't that be a great way to potentially make some money? I'd rather be on the bank side than a player, honestly, but I don't know. I'll throw my money in and I'll see how it goes, but definitely comment below if you guys have any questions about Edgeless. I'm here to help and, and sign up to Edgeless now. I'm gonna provide a link below where you can get free Edgeless tokens just by signing up. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.